Just wait, the night is young. Yeah. The night. So we're rolling. Oh, okay. So we'll do it live. <laughs> sure. I know you're looking at me. You always go first. I do always talk first, so you'll want to edit that. Uh, so Ryan and I, um, Wisconsin is home for us. We live in Indiana. Um, we're both very passionate about the industries we're involved in. Ryan's a musician. I'm an equestrian farm kid. Um, and so, you know, our goal is in five years to move home and live on a farm and have livestock and have dogs and be closer to family. And, um, you know, that is what started this entire thing. Like it's been, um, you know, our plan. It's part of our five year plan. And, and the only way we're going to make that happen is been with Dana, which I'm completely new to. Like I knew about this two days before we left. Ryan surprised me and it's absolutely changed my life. It's, it, it's unbelievable. And I love, love Wisconsin. I love the Wisconsin feel. Feels like home. So. Yeah, yeah everything she said. <laughs> <laughs> um, I mean, the biggest thing that strikes me about Dana is just how genuine he is. Like. You might have seen him do a webinar with, you know, somebody, and you're like, okay, you know, who's this guy? Is he really a goat farmer? You know, what's his deal? Yes, he is a goat farmer, um, but the the guy you see on, you know, TV is is the guy he is. I mean, he's just a genuine dude that's very relatable. So instantly working, you know, face to face, Dana, you just have that connection because he's just another guy. You know, he's not talking down to you. He's not this big, you know guru kind of guy where you feel inferior like he's really relatable and really easy to learn from because of it yeah. my mind because we literally just finished what three hours ago yeah um and i have like seriously 20 pages of notes so so much value that came out of this to i mean, I mean to say that one thing to point out one thing wouldn't be fair really to uh, you know the first couple of days we had with dana or the seven speakers we had today right. i mean everyone had really good nuggets that or pay for the price admission on their own. I, and my two cents is, I've been very, because I'm new to this whole thing, um, is an outsider's perspective. And it, every day you've asked us, you know, what did you learn from the other day? And I can't say one thing. So my first day was, my mind was blown. The second day, I felt inspired. And Dana's like, do you want to take over the world? And I said, absolutely. And, Today, it's I been, beep that part out. I now have permission to just go and be creative and the environment that um, allowed that to happen these last three days, staff, Dana, the speakers, everybody, uh, has, it's, there's something inside of me that I didn't even think was there.